Hello, my name is Dennis Ward, and I'm the founder of the uh, Green Tracking Service. And today, what we want to do is show you how we can put a GPS tracker, one of our trackers, the uh, GTS trackers, into a flat screen television. And we're going to send it downstream. We're going to take a look at it through our, our dashboard and see where it goes and make sure that it gets re, uh, recycled properly. So here is a 38 inch uh, flat screen television. Okay, it's your typical 38 inch. And you notice that in the back here, I have a beautiful TCL uh, TV that works. This one does not work and we're gonna get ready to send it downstream. So how do we go about doing that? Well, you see there's about 10 different screws that we already took out and uh, this will take off the back of the flat screen television. So I've done that. And what you do is you just take it off. Okay. And notice here, once you take off your back of the TV, inside you have essentially a shielded area where the television is. And inside there, there's, uh, of course, there's uh, ICs, you know, chips, and also the, the monitor, your focus materials. Okay, they're inside. And of course, this is the monitor on this side. And there's a host of other screws that we could take off and wiring. We already take, we already uh, took that out, uh, pretty much gutted it. And um, what's interesting is now we can put the tracker onto the metal surface. Now, here is one of our trackers. Uh, you have here the G, G, uh, GPS tracker. It uh, connects, of course, to the base stations via GSM, and we actually have dashboards for both of those, so you can see uh, the progress of this tracker. And so what we're going to do is we're going to place this tracker right onto the, the metal here that course has the uh, focus materials inside. So if you notice, listen to how it goes. Yes, we see that it has a strong magnet on our trackers and on, in, in fact, we have a, a little uh, uh, button that uh, gets depressed once you attach our tracker onto uh, the surface so that it gets armed for an alert if someone pulls it off. So it's quite interesting, but now, Notice that we have it here, and uh, again, it's a GPS tracker, so it actually radiates out. Now, you notice we didn't put it inside this metal. Most uh, devices, like PCs or TVs, they're designed with this shielding, metal shielding all around. And this metal shielding is so that uh, electromagnetic waves don't get out, uh, emissions don't get out to affect us, other humans. But we notice also GPS trackers are, you know, emits uh, rays or ENM e uh, signals. So we want to make sure that we don't shield, put the tracker inside the metal uh, area because that will cut off the communication to the satellites and also to the uh, base stations. So you notice we put it on top in this case. So we put it here and we know that the uh, signals can get out and it goes through most, most materials. And here we have uh, plastic that we're putting it over, right? But you notice here to make sure that we have the, the uh, best opportunity for the tracker to get through to the outside world, we actually have the grids here. If you notice on top of the TV, there's a, a grill here. And this grill uh, is, it has some strips, it's open, and we see that the uh, tracker can actually uh, go out and, and communicate to the outside world in an in a, uh, easy way. And we want to give, of course, the tracker the best, the best uh, chance to do that communication because we know that this TV is going to actually go into maybe a Gaylord with some other things around it, and we, we do encourage you to put this TV maybe on top or at least where it can actually uh, have a chance to, to communicate with the satellites and the base stations. And then of course, this may even be going to a cargo bin. And with GPS, GPS is designed to be outside. It may go dark, of course, when it goes inside. 
but at least they, we may be able to communicate GSM and we can capture that as well. But the reality is, is that's, that's what we have to uh, uh, be aware of. But this is, we wanna make, give it the best opportunity. So we want you to put the tracker in a location where it can actually radiate and actually uh, communicate. Now, if there's a, a case where you have to put it too far inside, we do uh, encourage you to put a hole or something where the uh, tracker can actually communicate. Just wanted to make that a, a very clear point here for us. Okay, so now we disconnect it. We will screw the, uh, the screws back into the holes and then we'll be able and ready to send this TV downstream. So stay tuned with us as we uh, look at the uh, dashboards and follow this, this uh, device downstream. Okay, thank you.